Yeah, this is uh, John Knight from Norton News. And uh, with the current uh, polling day of the way it shows with, uh, um, with uh, Mitt Romney at 73, uh, 73 delegates and uh, Obama, Mr. Obama with uh, 64 total delegates. Uh, I think it's uh, safe to say we can uh, for, uh, possibly predict a winner in the uh, presidential race. Uh, they found uh, at least uh, half of the country's uh, polling places have already uh, submitted their data. And uh, what we see uh, is that uh, while Mr. Obama has certainly uh, made uh, a great in, great strides in, uh, in, in getting to the uh, 270 uh, vote count in the uh, electoral college that is needed in order to uh, for a minimum that's needed in order to uh, become uh, president for a second time. Uh, however, uh, Mitt Romney is, uh, uh, has a substantial lead in uh, the delegate count and continues to uh, gain more, more traction in, in, in swing states such as Virginia and uh, Texas and Florida, as well as California and Ohio and New Hampshire. So uh, we're going to project that uh, uh, Mitt Romney is the winner for the uh, President of the United States. And uh, this is based on current uh, polling data and uh, as is 8.30 p.m. in the, uh, so we're projecting the winner again, as I said, uh, as being uh, Mr. Mitt Romney for uh, President of the United States. This is John Norton for Norton News.